I finally decided to pick up a uh, bigger CPU cooler because the stock one was, you know, sounding like a hair dryer and uh, was driving me crazy. So I picked up a Cooler Master Hyper 212 Plus uh, on the recommendation from another YouTube user that I watch frequently. And uh, so far it works great. Um, it wasn't all that hard to mount either really. The hardest part was putting the bracket on the back side of the motherboard. And uh, really it was a lot of work because I had the whole computer spread out on my desk which I barely have any room to work. And uh, had to use one hand to hold the motherboard up and the other hand to hold the screwdriver and it, it got kind of tricky. But um, The fan did come in contact with the first RAM chip but uh, since it's on plastic clips I was able to slide it up just a little bit you can kind of see there and uh, it works perfectly really the only noise that I can hear is this fan in the back of the case here makes an annoying hum I'm probably gonna switch that back to the stock fan that the case came with uh, as long as the temperatures hold steady but yeah so far it works great I've got uh see here if I can get some focus on this. The uh, CPU is at 40 degrees Celsius and the uh, system is also at 40 degrees Celsius. It's funny the temperature actually went up when I took the side panel off probably because the, the airflow got screwed up but if you want to see how loud the CPU fan is at full speed I can turn off the auto fan And now you can hear the the fan on that Cooler Master. Uh, that's as loud as it gets. Really, it's kind of a soothing sound. Much better than the high pitched uh, high pitched scream that the stock cooler made. I think the stock cooler had a like a 60 or 70 millimeter fan. It was a noisy thing. Way too small for a quad core processor. Go back to the hardware monitor here. You can see the CPU fan settles down at about 1300 RPMs, uh, you know, at normal temperature. So it's much better than the 50 degrees Celsius I was getting before, and 10 times quieter.